Can you solve this logic test puzzle? Here's the question. The first candle burns off in 4 hours and the second candle in 6 hours. Now the question is, how long until the first candle will be half the height of the second candle? You can pause this video if you want to give this problem a try. And now let's answer this question together. So the question goes like this. The first candle burns off in 4 hours and the second candle in 6 hours. So the question is how long it takes for the first candle will be half the height of the second candle. Now I see this puzzle as a distance problem. So we're in the whole distance, let's call this as D. This is the height of the candle. And let's call this candle, the first candle, the fastest candle, as candle A and the second candle, candle B. Now we know candle A must be faster than candle B. Now in illustration, this looks something like this. So as you can see, candle A is faster than candle B. We're in the first candle burns off in 4 hours and the second candle burns off in 6 hours. Now our goal here is what time or how long until the first candle will be half the height of the second candle. So now since we convert this puzzle into a distance problem, now we can now get the rate of candle A and candle B. Now the rate of candle A must be equal to D over 4 because it burns out in 4 hours. Or simply, we can say that in 4 hours, candle A completes this distance. Now, the rate of candle B must be equal to D over 6. Now, our focus right here is how long until the first candle will be half the second candle. So, this looks something like this. Since the first candle burns off faster, so the first candle must be shorter than the second candle. So the illustration looks something like this. Now here, the distance traveled of candle A must be equal to, in time t, must be equal to d times t all over 4, or d over 4 times d. Now the distance traveled by this candle B must be equal to d over 6 times t. Now, this distance right here must be the length of the candle after time t. So, how long is this candle? So, the length of this candle must be equal to the whole distance d minus d over 4 times t. So, this is just d minus dt over 4. Now, how about this distance? This is the length of the second candle after time t. So this is just the total length d minus dt over 6. Now at this point, we know that the height of the first candle must be half the height of the second candle. So we can say that d minus dt over 4 all over d minus dt over 6 must be equal to 1 over 2. Now we have an equation in terms of total distance d and time t. Now take note that we need to find the time t. Now, how do we solve for the value of t? Now, take note, on the numerator and the denominator, we can factor out d. So, this can be written as d multiplied by 1 minus t over 4. And on the denominator, we have d multiplied by 1 minus t over 6. Now, take note that we can cancel the variable d. It means that the distance or the height of the candle doesn't matter at all. So let's continue. Let's simplify first the numerator 1 minus t over 4. So this is just 4 minus t over 4. And the denominator, this can be simplified as 6 minus t over 6. Now, 4 minus t over 4 all over 6 minus t over 6 can be written as follows. We have 6 multiplied by 4 minus t all over 4 multiplied by 6 minus t. Now we can simplify this 6 over 4. This is just 3 over 2. Now, to cancel this factor, let's multiply both sides by 2 over 3. 
Now, 1 half multiplied by 2 over 3, this is just 1 over 3. Now, let's solve for the value of t. First, let's multiply both sides by 3. And then, let's multiply both sides by 6 minus t. Now, let's distribute this 3. This is just 12 minus 3t. Now, let's add t on both sides and subtract 12 on both sides. And now, negative 3t plus t, this will give us negative 2t, and 6 minus 12 is just negative 6. Divide both sides by negative 2, so we have t equals negative 6 over negative 2, or simply equal to 3. Therefore, our answer to this logic puzzle, how long until the first candle will be half the height of the second candle, and our answer is in 3 hours, the first candle will be half the height, the second candle. And as always, we are done.